Hey, Rick the UK Spark here, how you Hi. doing? In this video, I'm going to be taking out an old fuse box board, 12 months old by the way, out of fitted, and put in a brand new burst old board. Let me just start by saying I'm not being paid to do this video at all. Um, I am, the only sponsorship I've got really, I say sponsorship, is materials from the, the company that I work for, PHLEC. I'll put the link down below on Instagram, please go and follow them. Um, they've been great, uh, they let me do my videos, um, so yeah, I'm just going to go why we're doing, why I've changed it, what I like about it, um, why I've moved up to first off from Fusebox, uh, and the importance of um, surge protection, um, so let's get into it shall we, Woo, it's hot. Right, all right guys. Right, I'm gonna go through this for you. I'm not gonna make this a really long video. Most of my videos are really long, so. This is under my stairs. This is my house. That was the view, that's not finished it yet. So, I've got everything I need, so protection, blah, blah, blah. It was just a quick job when I moved in. I worked to rewire it, but I didn't. So that's that. Pedro's put a nice sewing for me, very nice of him when I moved in. So this is the board. Let's just move out a bit on camera. Oh, it's come from somewhere that. So I've not even opened it yet. So what I'm gonna do is I usually label up my I didn't labeled up that. Obviously it's my house. I should have done. I'm going to use everything they send me. So I'm not gonna be using my label machine. I am going to use what they send me. So just to prove you can use You've got everything you need for this board. Um, obviously, you might need glands and whatnot, uh, but I'm not going to. So I'm bringing the tails through the back. I've uh, got my RCBOs here. I've not looked at these yet. I've got some blanks. This is what I want. I said to you before, beginning of the video. Uh, nice packaging. So let's have a look at these RCBOs. Very nice. They don't feel cheap either. Um, yeah, they're brilliant. So I'm going to unpack this and um, get that board off the wall. Um, I'm going to give that one away. I'm going to give it away to a to a college or something like that. So I'll see if your boards, local college. Um, yeah, let's go and strip in the uh, the old board, shall we? Right, there you go, that's all out now. Um forgotten I bolted it on. I don't know why I did that, so I tried something else. Uh, with these roof bolts. And I couldn't get to this one, but I'll get it off in the end. That's a good thing really, isn't it? So I've got all this back now. Hopefully the board fits on here because I've not measured it. Um otherwise I'm putting that one back on, aren't I? <laughs> um but yeah, um let's get to uh getting this new first saw board on. Um got plenty of length in here, made sure he had anyway, um, so I do want to rewire the house, but it's all time isn't it, it's all time that you could be spending with your children or on FIFA, on COD, so priorities in it, let's get this board on, right so I've got the uh, face, I've had to move it down, it's warm today, I think it's be Tenerife weather next week isn't it, Anyway, um, yeah, I've had to move the board down. Uh, it was a bit too big. Obviously, I didn't get this board to, to put in my house. It's what I got. So um, well, that's what I want. So basically, let's ex extend two lighting circuits. That's not too bad. So uh, yeah, it's. I've had to, obviously the board was up here, so I've had to move it down here. I've got plenty of length now. Um, for that, you can't go wrong. Don't you love it when you get a board and you've got all this? So, I put the grommet strip in. I need to go to my workshop to get some more tails because I don't think they'll uh, they'll reach and they'll come around the back here. Um, so yeah, it's it's quite good. I've got it so there's not much space in there. You've got to get your things in there. This one I'll, I'll fill in anyway. 
Uh, but yeah, it's it's a uh, it's it's quite a nice board. So uh, I'll uh, I'll get them all stripped back and get them dressed in, and then I'll tell you um, the the pros and cons of it. I'll give my honest opinion, uh, which uh, the owners of first all know that I I told them I'll only give an honest opinion. Uh, so let's start stripping some stuff. Right, I've got that on now. Um, for some reason, my camera uh, didn't record. I've got the sound, but not the um, the video. The wiring up, so which is a bit of a pain. So, um, so anyway, it's all wired up, um, and we'll just so I'll just talk about what I thought about it and what I like about it now. Let's have a look inside. There you go. I mean, it's not the, the it's not the neatest, but uh, it's in my house. Um, as you can see, it's plenty of room, loads of room to terminate. I mean, look at the bottom there. Look at all that space. It's just, I've not, I, you know, it's just still room. I mean, if you wanted to add to this <coughs> to this board, say from underneath, you got loads of room. You're not fighting. You no, know, with other cables, um, yeah, it's really nice. And when when you tighten them up, um, they don't move over. You know, sometimes when you when you put your your, your breakers in and, and your RCBOs, even your torque driver, after a while, the breakers start moving like that, and it's hard to get the lid on. Not one of these have done that. Um, tail clamps is great. It, it, I was looking at it for not so look, look it was going to fit, and it does. Um, so yeah it's 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 all right um there's the job got a little level in there to make sure obviously it's level so but i had to obviously move it down um uh, so that's that done uh, yeah it's a nice board i'll just uh i've got obviously got a label it and stuff i would rather fit this than a fuse box board, it just feels better, it looks better. So that's just my honest opinion. I so I won't, probably won't be doing any more fuse box boards. I'll only be using Verso. Um, I don't think they do commercial, nor your big free fares yet. But <clears throat> they'll get there. They're a domestic, domestic uh, supplies to the supply that all your accessories which i'll do some videos on on some of the accessories especially the, the uh switch view spares are really good all the terminals going across the top no twisting uh to get terminals in so i've got to test this which i'm not going to do now i'm going to show you that I've, I've got to do it for myself um i'll get it certificated uh so these are the stickers so obviously you know you don't really need these labels on anymore I still put mine on I just I like to go to a board and see them last night was inspected not too bothered about the uh, the testing uh, testing the RCD sticker uh, but that I mean it's you know you've got the sticker here installed by approved by telephone number and inspection I mean a lot of people use them on but if you haven't but it's got all the stickers you need so I'm going to use this uh, instead of my labeler, get that marked up. So if you want to ask any questions on it, uh, if you want to know anything, just give us a, a just comment on, or you can go on my Instagram, or you can go straight to um, Verso on Instagram, and they're also on YouTube. So I'm going to leave um, I'll leave the link down below, and you, you can go and see them. So I'm, I put my Instagram on there as well on my Twitter, but go and see Verso. They they have they make time for the customers. They like your feedback. Because if there's something you don't like about it, tell them. Um, obviously, don't ring them up giving them grief and say, look, I think this could be improved. It's, they like the feedback because they want they want their boards to be the best boards, which to be fair is probably one of the best boards I've fitted. It's just the room I've got in it. It's just and it does look nice. So I'll get the lid on, I'll show you what it looks like the lid on. So there's the front. Beautiful. Look at that. 
it feels sturdy as well next video is going to be about spds um the importance of spds i mean the amount of times i've been to jobs give a quote for a board change and i've probably been the third electrician there to give them a quote and i've, met, I've brought up spds and they don't even know what one is the, the last electrician has not even mentioned it to him i put these in all my boards no matter what um i just think it's worth having so yeah i'll go through that on my next video and uh yeah beautiful any problems you want any information i can direct you to the right people at verso if you want to stop this in if you've got to know you've got a store whatever um let us know i mean you can contact verso you know direct but if you if you're struggling to find anything which i doubt you will because they're very good um just give us a just comment in down below or my instagram or my twitter i just want to finish this video and letting people know there's a, a giveaway in this video i don't know if you've seen in the, the thumbnail yes there's a giveaway there's five garage units verso garage units going out for grabs all you have to do is go on my instagram and follow the instructions on there and you could be one of the lucky winners to win one of these garage units they are nice sat same sat the same what i've fitted today um but smaller and they are good and once you've tried one of them i promise you you will move on to the verso boards you will not use any other board so yeah uh check out the instagram thanks for waiting to the end to find out what you need to do unless you skipped it all um, and if there's anything else you want to see on the verso boards if you need to know anything uh, just leave it in comments uh, so yeah hope, hopefully I hear from you soon um, if you're not on Instagram just send us a message and we'll we'll see how we can uh, get you entered into the competition so uh, thanks to PH Lec. Uh thank you to Verso um, been great and uh, thanks to everyone that's watching and everyone that's subscribed to me um, I just want to get my channel bigger um, and it's not not the easiest thing you think just people to subscribe but they don't um, obviously I've not been doing I've not been doing this a year yet so but yeah thank you everyone for uh, subscribing and I will see you next week